Hello. How you all doing today? Hope you all are fine. Doing well. Today I'm in the mood to make some bread. Fresh bread. And uh, I'm going to be making it. Uh, it's going to be in my channel called, uh, or playlist called Bread Maker's Delight. Uh, you may want to check that out. It may be on that. Or it may be as a new release. You might see it. I'm not sure how that works. But uh, either way, I have my bread maker, the ingredients, and uh, I'll make a close up of that. You'll be able to see how much I'm using. A very simple process to make bread. And uh, we'll do that now. As you can see, we have uh, three cups of sugar, one cup of water. We have uh, sugar, one and a half teaspoons. This to remind me, it's salt. <laughs> one and a half teaspoons of salt. One pack of uh, yeast, and we have uh, butter. I have it at uh, room temperature, melted. So we're going to place all this in the bread maker. And uh, it's a very simple process. Uh, my bread maker requires that I uh, put in the liquids first and then the solids. So that's what we'll do. So we're going to open this baby up here and uh, get a little close up on it. There you go. All right, so I'm going to start with the liquids, uh, which is the water. Get that right in there. And the next liquid is the butter. That's all there is. I'll try not to bang things around here. This takes about two and a half hours to process. It may seem like a long time, but it's not when you start to uh, uh, relaxing, enjoying, watching TV, whatever. Um, that time goes by quick and it automatically shuts off and lets you know. And it's got a warming cycle in case uh, you forget. So next step is the flour. Three cups of flour. And we got the sugar. I put the sugar on the side and I'll tell you why in a minute. Then I have... Uh, the salt, I have to put that away from the sugar because it's for, uh, I'll tell you why in a minute. <laughs> and then the last part is the uh, yeast, any brand is fine. So here's the yeast. Now, here's where you got to be careful with the yeast. You don't want to start fermenting. So what we do is put a circle in the center of the uh, flour. And we put the yeast right in there, away from the sugar, away from the salt. That's good. Okay. Now, um, it's all set, ready to go. All we got to do now is set the uh, machine. So that's what we'll do. And uh, every machine is different, so it all depends on your brand. Um, this brand here, uh, I don't have the name of it, and I forgot. <laughs> it's at least 10 years old, and it's still very good. Um, it operates very well. It, it, they last forever, really. They, they they go on forever. This is my fourth, fifth bread machine. Well, you say, what, they last forever? Why is that your fifth? Because I sold the other four as I moved. I didn't need all those bread machines, and I didn't need a lot of stuff, so... And this one I just uh, I purchased uh, oh, about two years ago uh, online. So it only cost a few dollars. They're very cheap online. Well, they were anyway. So here's I'm going to set it. Uh, the menu is, is what kind you want. Basic, rapid, sweet, and, you know, uh, how many pounds. Uh, we're going to go with... Uh, oh, let's see here. 
we're going to go wrap it and we're going to hit two pounds that's what we got and we are also going to go a bit light I like my bread to be soft and not too hard so if you go uh, medium or hard uh, or dark it's going to be kind of hard at the end if you dark and I don't like my crust to be hard so okay so we're all set the timer is uh, two minutes and uh, two hours and 20 minutes no problem I'll set my timer on my microwave and uh, we'll get that going once I get the thing started uh, two hours is 120 and 140 Okay, all set. Now all I gotta do is close the lid and press start. As you can hear, it's already starting. And I'm gonna give you a closer view here on the inside so you get to see the starting process. There we go. There we go. I think that looks good. It's a very slow process first. I think that Try not to make a mess and just get everything well acquainted with each other. <laughs> the flour and the salt and the yeast. So, to me, that doesn't look like it has enough liquids. But all to ask for is a cup of water. So, we'll see how it goes. Um, I might add more water to it if I feel that uh, it's, uh, too, it's not solid enough. Uh, or doughy enough, then I might just add some more water. As a matter of fact, I'll do that right now. Okay, I've got the water ready to go. I'm not going to add it yet. Um, I'll wait till it gets done. It's uh, spinning and mixing everything together. And once that's done, then uh, I'll check it again and see how it goes. So, for now, we're going to close it down and then we'll take a break. 